STEM subjects are often deemed to be difficult, and Makata has gone the extra mile to make physical sciences a favorite subject for her learners at Violetu High School. Her passion has produced great results and gained her pole position for excellence in teaching physical sciences. What our society uh, believes in terms of the STEM subjects. People always say maths is difficult, physics is difficult. If you, if a child says they have physics and they subject that they, well, that subject is difficult. So uh, at school level, we ensure that we expose learners to a lot of information, and uh, kids are here to learn. So we go out of our way to teach them. We do whatever is required to ensure that they understand. Makata makes learning a collective effort rather than an individual one by involving her learners. A method, they say, assists them to better understand the subject matter. MEM doesn't just give us physics as it is, but then she makes it much simpler for all of us to understand most of the time because some of us don't understand certain topics, but then when MEM starts explaining, we then grasp that this topic leads to this and with perfect examples around us. I used to be like, no, I won't be able to do physics because of, of how people used to say, physics is hard, don't do physics. But like, I was like, no, I want to do it because I know my potential. So because of my kata, I, I am able to challenge physics, even though it's hard sometimes. As more than 16,000 candidates will be writing their final exams in the province, Makata will be offering Matrix extra support to help them finish strong. A report from the Department of Basic Education revealed that in 2024, the physical sciences pass rate was 75.6%, a slight decrease from 76.2% in 2023. Garabosiyoko, SABC News, Kimberley.